Welcome to Frank's Food Picks, Part 7. I am in heaven today. I'm at a donut shop. In fact, maybe the donut shop in St. Louis. Pharaoh's in downtown St. Louis. This place is so good that many donut shops around the St. Louis area actually buy from them. Let's go inside one of the great donut places in the country. Actually, we begin outside on 7th Street. The light says to stop. Good idea, stop and eat. The sign is not real glitzy, doesn't have to be with these donuts. We like to put out a fresh donut every day and, and I think that's what brings people here. They taste a really good product uh, that they don't really get other way. This is 57-year-old Aman Aziz, a Sumner grad who has put his heart and soul into this business for 24 years. Now, how about that name, Pharaohs? Aman was a Pharaoh. All right, and, uh, and when I was getting ready to open up the business, I didn't want to put my name on the front. And when I happened to read an article about the great pharaohs of Africa, and Amon was one of them, I said, that's it, pharaohs gone. Let's watch them in action. Let's begin with the dough and chef Preston Smith. As you see, I snapped it. Okay, it's important that we shape it up. And then is now, and the, another thing that's important is the flour. Now what the flour does, you probably already know this from your own experience of cooking, it stops it from sticking. Then it goes through the cutter. Then these twisters are shaped. After that, they're put in the proof box for a half hour on low heat, which activates the yeast. It's time to cook them, 350 degrees for just about a minute. A little icing for these bad boys. Now keep in mind, Pharaoh's makes 300 dozen donuts a day. The world is about to end. Okay. You can eat two last donuts here at Pharaoh's. Okay. I would have to go with a glazed donut and a, and a cake, glazed cake. Oh, wow. Wow. Folks, if you get a chance and you're in downtown St. Louis and you want to have a donut, Try the chocolate long john at Pharaoh's. And if you have any food ideas, food suggestions for me for our next food picks, email me at fcusumano at ksdk.com.